Hello everyone, I'm Sarah and welcome to 1213 Prescott Way. If you haven't subscribed, please do so right now and hit that notification bell so that you will be notified when we post another video. A video. I said a video, 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 video. Oh, oh, oh. Hit that like and subscribe button. Hit that like and subscribe button. Hit that like. Hit that subscribe. Hit that like and subscribe. So, you guys, I have a treat here. You know, my little quesadillas that I like. It, it has spinach, tomatoes, and Mexican blend cheese inside. Get you a good look at that. I don't know if you can see everything in there because it's folded. And then I have some. I was going to do just um, grilled vegetable, well, stir fried vegetables with um, broccoli, spinach, onion, red bell pepper, yellow bell pepper. And then I decided to add shrimp. I had like six shrimp left. So I was like, and you know, I was getting rid of the bell pepper and all that stuff because I don't like to waste food. So I like to use it. And then I have a Mai Tai. Yes, you heard right, a Mai Tai. Not your Thai, Mai Tai. Very delicious, but I won't be drinking all of it because it is very potent. And then I also have a bottle of water. So today is Thursday, what are you guys getting into? I am very excited. I don't know. Well, I do know why because I don't let things get me down. I know one thing. This hair is hot. <laughs> but it sure is cute. So anyway, you guys, I am going to get into it once I eat some food and let you know someone tried to kill Beep. me. I will tell you all about it. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. 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 Okay. Mm. Talk about hungry. Um, I wasn't going to put I wasn't going to put any seasoning in it in the vegetables because I normally use um I normally just leave it like that because I like the taste the flavors of the actual vegetables. But I just added a little Mrs. Dash because I forgot I was going to put shrimp. So, you know, the shrimp has all the um, flavor. Because I will season that, you know, with lemon and, and then the seasoning. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. 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 Look. Look at the shrimp. See the shrimp? Mmm. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. And for David, I made him some barbecue chicken, and he has some vegetables without the shrimp. And then I went, you know, later on, because he doesn't get in until like 11. So at about 10 o'clock, I'll go ahead and put on some rice for him. That Mexican blend cheese seemed to have like some kind of sweetness to it or something. Mm-hmm. But sure is delicious. Like I said, let me get some bites in. And then I'll tell you about someone trying to kill me. <laughs> Literally. Mm. Mm-mm. -mm. Take a bite. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I hate to brag, but every time I visualize some, you know, my dinner or what I plan on making, I always outdo myself. 
And I'm not joking. If only there was smell of vision and, and taste of vision. You would surely agree. Look at that. With the spinach and. Mm. I would say I'm having a pretty healthy meal. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. I always was going to do something, but I was going to do tuna fish sandwiches. Mm. But the real reason I didn't do them is because I, did, I forgot I didn't get any sweet relish. If you want to know the truth, if you want to know the truth about it, mm. so let me take this last bite. Take me a drink of my mark time. Mm. I bought those on um, this Mai Tai um, last Friday because I was going to take it to David's show, but then I didn't feel like drinking, so I just left it. So I've had it a week. Mm. No, I didn't make it. It's the canned ones you get in the store. So I don't even know what it tastes like, but I usually like them. Um, they have enough kick that I only need one. So I'm going to taste it. This one's a different Mai Tai. I've tried a, the Mai Tai before, but this was a different brand, and it is delicious. It's actually very potent. Mmm. Here's to it. Mmm. 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 Talk about delicious. Mm. Mm. I knew this is what I was going to eat last night. I was going to have it for um, lunch. What did I have instead? Oh yeah, I had a peanut butter and jelly sandwich instead. Mmm. So it's making me hot. Mmm. I forgot I was going to get started. <laughs> okay. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mmm. You Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mmm. I think meat lovers, you would love the Mexican blend because it kind of tastes like meat. Mm-hmm. When it's melted, you know, and then eaten with the other, with the um, spinach and the tomatoes. Mm. Mm -hmm. So anyway, you guys,
Mm. Wipe them out. Mm, excuse me. So, I was on my way to work this morning. And so I'm behind a truck. So as I'm as I'm behind him going, I see this truck and a vehicle behind it. They're in on this side street and they want to make that left turn in front of us. So I'm watching the truck and you I, for, uh, intuition i'm telling you i can feel that he was just anxious just want to go he didn't he wasn't moving he wasn't re um, veering up the vehicle or anything like i could hear it if he was i couldn't but i for some reason i just honed in on him because you know cars are always turning in front of us and stuff but i'm always aware of everybody and um trying to predict what they're going to do but i actually felt that this man was going to just zoom out as soon as that car in front of me went. And so as we are approaching, mind you, I'm behind him. So he, I was like, that angle that we're at, he doesn't see me. Although we traveled down, far, you know, all that way there, he should have seen us coming from afar. But obviously he didn't. And I just felt that he didn't. And so as we're coming, this car, he passes. And as soon as he passes, this car zooms out, the truck zooms out in front of me like that. And I had my foot over the brake as the car in front of me was passing him because I just had, like I said, I had that feeling he was going to do that. And that's exactly what he did. So I was able to slam on my brake and he went like this and his rear, you know, the passenger side door was right here. And I was able to swerve to the side because I already knew what he was going to do. So it was like this. And then he, he's going to go, you know, like he's trying to avoid me now all of a sudden. I'm like, it's all over now. I've already avoided you. Now you see me and now you try, you know, I was like, oh my gosh, people trying to kill you before you get to work. <laughs> so, and I, I know when I, I took it even further, when after that had happened, I was thinking about the vehicle, that, the car that was behind him, because I know I was thinking that that car was saying, don't do it, don't do it. There's a car coming, don't do it, you know, and I was like, okay. Usually I'm rattled for a minute, but for, but I wasn't because I already knew it would be okay because I had already, like I said, predicted what he was going to do and I knew what I was going to do. So I avoided a big, because he was a truck. And then the last truck that, the yeah, the last vehicle that hit me in Vegas was a truck. So, I, and, and I'm not paranoid about trucks anymore, but it happened to be another truck because you know these people love their trucks so there's a lot of those um pickup trucks it's one of those four-door big old ford pickup trucks so yeah honey so that's what happened and i am here to talk about it i was like i'm going to tell david when i get to work but of course i started working and didn't tell him until i got home so i'm like these four these bugs and that's the second time that has happened to me where uh, somebody pulled out in front of me and not only did they pull out in front of me I was I knew that that's what they were going to do that's the second time that happened mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Mm. I'm going to be going shortly because I don't like the flies. I told David today I cannot wait until summer is over. Mm. Take a bite. Mm. So I just want to say thank you so much for watching, listening, and I am like grateful and fortunate that I am here to tell you about what happened and I just want to say thank you for coming in and listening and supporting the channel and 
it helps a great deal because you know with the algorithms it helps when you like or co and comment so that YouTube knows that people are watching and then they'll send it so other people can see it so instead of messaging me directly like texting and you know messaging me on uh, messenger go ahead and put your comments in this video okay and let me know if you have experienced any of those crazy drivers or if you're one of those crazy drivers <laughs> it goes both ways so anyway love you thank you so much and have a wonderful rest of your evening and if it's morning have a rest of your great rest of your day afternoon all that good stuff and have a good night love you peace